food. We all love it, but what's your favorite food memory? My name's Alana Johnston, and this is Food for Thought. Do you have any favorite food memories? I guess my favorite food memory is my grandmother used to make pineapple pound cake. It was always either lopsided or like something like... I can get the lopsided part of any meal down for you if you need help. That's, that's no problem over here. I'm get, I got it. I got it covered. <laughs> What's your favorite food memory? Going to Korea and eating live octopus. It's a, it's a bit frightening. You really have to chew it up or else it might grab your throat on the way down. Okay, so that time you were almost murdered by an octopus was your favorite food memory? Absolutely. Wow. <laughs> Probably eating brunch with my family on Christmas morning. I was going <laughs> to say the time my mom gave me uh, grape juice and then I projectile vomited it all over the wall. What do you think? Are you in therapy? <laughs> Probably my first cup of coffee. Can that, does that count as food? I think so. How old were you? Uh, I was about five and my nan, or my grandma, made me a cup of Folgers back in Australia. I'm, I'm sorry, you were five and you got coffee? Yeah. <laughs> no, back then it was totally fine, there was probably whiskey in it. Me and my two best friends, um, we just randomly decided to go to Dave's Hot Chicken in oh, yeah. Culver City. Since then, we've been going to like different chicken shops all over the LA area and like raiding them and everything. So, oh my God, you should be hosting this show. <laughs> I'm stealing your job then, I guess. Uh, cut that, cut that part. Okay. A friend of mine decided to do a prank on me and said, "You should try this spice." He's like, "Put your finger in the spice and just like give it a little sniff." And I did, and he like put like so much spice up my nose and I started crying and I wasn't able to eat for the rest of the evening. Okay, uh, very traumatic it sounds like. My parents are immigrants, so anytime they would cook and come home after a meal, we'd just sit together. That was so heartfelt. <laughs> I was gonna say that time I got a free pastry, but that's okay. <laughs> that counts too. <laughs> Any advice about food for people in general? Eat what you like and learn to cook it. Oh, I don't know about that second part, but thanks. It was so nice to meet you. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you. Oh, is this? No, no, just, just this. Just this? Yep. We want to hear your thoughts, so get in that comment section, answer our questions, and don't forget to subscribe while you're there. Thanks for watching, and thanks to Blueies for having us.